There seems to have been a lot of fire and insight with questions prior to this and, and release and, and, you know, just... The, the old eye is, is illusionary and and then there's this question now that's just has it seem as though I'm I'm back stuck again yes uh, you or what <sighs> let's slow down again uh, you who is stuck again is, is what Put some images to your words and, and look at your stuck self and see if it is true. If it's not just something made up. What can you call yourself to be stuck? Are you form or formless? Only a form can seem stuck. How can the formless be stuck? Or have you not reached that place yet, you see? Mm. Otherwise, we stop this right now, throw everything away. Throw everything away, including this question. Let's try another door. Throw everything away. All concerns away. Throw, 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 until there's nothing left to throw. Do it quickly. The house is on fire. Throw, 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 throw. Throw, throw. What cannot be thrown? Throw even the hands that throw. And witness what remain here. Don't, no imagination is needed. Don't imagine. Some supernatural police have come and they're going to do a strip search. They go through your body, they take everything, all your clothes, all your things, they take everything, then you're completely naked. Then you say, well, that's not me. They're looking for you. They're looking for you. Where are you? They, they take your clothes. All the pockets empty, empty, empty. Close, close, close. Out, out, out. Everything. The clothes are gone. Organs now. Heart. Poof, take out. Kidney. Boom. <laughs> Lungs. Blood. <laughs> Eyes. <laughs> Which are you? Will they find you? Hmm? Take everything. Boom, 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 boom. Everything. Bones. Flesh. Take everything. Where is she? Where is she? Your thought. Ah, memory, we found her. Take. Pull. <laughs> Something watches. Memory gone. Mm -hmm. Kid kidney gone. Lungs gone. Mm -hmm. Heart gone. Bladder gone. <laughs> huh? Memories gone, desire gone, attachments gone, everything, everything that can be found is gone. They're taking everything. They're raiding this house. Everything is out. Hmm? Blood gone, marrow, bones, everything gone. Who are you? Where will they find you? Oh, this is, I, mm. It's too gruesome an example. No, no, I. Oh. It's, <laughs> it's a strong sense of frustration. I, I yeah. feel like I've come to this place many times. I don't know. Frustration if this is gone. <laughs> <laughs> the one who has come to this place also gone. Also. Come play with me. Come play with me. My game is very good. Okay. Something keeps referring always back to the past, to the past notion or self-image of you. 
and you can always wake it up. Something always wakes it up through memory. Yes, the way I was before. My last memory recreate my whole self. But that is also seen. The last time we came here, we'll finish like that today with this simple exercise. You can all participate. It's very much like I've been speaking. We've all shown up. You've all shown up. And before you can uh, go into your final satsang, we have some tests for you. Like this. Huh? First, you will come. We have to uh, remove uh, phenomenally everything that is not original to you. Everything that's not original, we are going to have to leave it because we need to step on this scale. Uh, this uh, metaphysical scale, and only we need a reading at this precise moment hmm, of what is original to you, everything that is organic. So all your contact lenses you have to take out, your body rings, all these things, any sort of like uh, uh, false things, false eyelashes, weave ons, anything like that, you know, your 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 fillings, all this type of stuff. We take everything out. Then we are going to. Everything that's not rich. We, okay, at this time, scale way exactly. Boom, thank you. Only what is original we want. Now to the next machine. Whatever is not original with you, this must be removed also before you can go to satsang. So all your memories, they are not original to you. We will take them out. Thank you. Out. All your projections, out. Your name also, not original. The body did not come with a name on it. Name, take out. Out there. All your relationships and the memory of them, we take out. Out there. All your desires, take out. All your projections, take out. They are not original to you. Your identity, who you think you are, and how you want to be, and not the original. Come out. Okay. Mm-hmm. All your dreams, no, not the original. Out. Okay. Your beliefs. Shut <sighs> them out. All your experiences. Oh, but they were not original, they came later. Throughout. Your devotion. Yes, devotion. A little bit. Yeah. Out. Let's step out, let's take a check and we look and see anything hiding anywhere. <laughs> ah, very good. Now only what is original. Who are you? Don't answer anything from the past, not original, just ideas. Future, speculation, nothing. Imagination. Something we cannot take out somehow. It was not a development, not a construction. It's not a thought. So we cannot take. What is this? Thank you. 
eyes still functioning, senses still functioning. They're not a problem. There's a silence about them. Fear? Yes. It's still there? Fear? Fear. <laughs> yes. Well, we took past out, no? Can fear stay without past? No. We took memory out. Can fear stay without memory? We took identity out. Can fear stay uh, without identity? Perhaps there is a desire to, to retain identity. Maybe there is a desire to retain identity, so therefore there is a fear of losing identity. But if identity goes, then what is, to be, what is left? What can I count on? Maybe some place would regard this conversation as a very dangerous thing to be doing. This is very dangerous work. Hmm. Because without that personal self-belief, you cannot be manipulated. And whatever kind of stubbornness there is inside, why give it uh, so much importance? Why believe that that there is something there? There's something. There's something still blocking. Blocking what? Are you tightening your heart in any way? Yeah. Why is that? You see, that's not what brought you to satsang. That is what is trying to prevent your satsang. Stay with your higher choice. This is just the seed of avoidance. Something is a little it wants reassurances, it wants some security, these type of things that come up. And it has been playing uh, in your life. The need to be safe. To not go too far, that your risks are not too big, something it stops you, suffocates your spontaneity, your dance. I can only point it out. The rest you must do. It's up to you, and uh, I'm not waiting with expectation. 
It's just a chance you must take or leave. It's up to you. I'm here to take it. Mm. And then you must choose it. Not only want it. I'm also quite lost being in this space and feeling no no energy to push on. I mean my whole satsang and even last year had just it's just you know full power and now it's you don't want to push on then let's go the other way. It's just as good. Then leave everything then. You have no energy to go forward, then stop. And then drop everything then. Whichever direction you go, uh, as I said, uh, there, right there is a door to your inmost being. Uh, don't fight with yourself. Uh, I don't have the energy to go forward, uh, then don't go forward. Don't go forward. I just feel like stopping, I just feel like relaxing, just dropping. Then drop everything then. Then oh I don't want to drop everything. Hmm? You are freedom itself. You are love itself. There is no other source for joy but your own self. But you make believe all of this. <laughs> You're here. Huh? But you cannot accept your own freedom. That's why I say, then uh, your mind has dirted every concept. So then throw every concept away then. For the moment, throw everything away. Don't go there. You are there before concepts. You are here before concepts. Without you, concepts have no meaning, they have no power. Don't you see this? Without you, concepts have no meaning, have no power. Either you believe, you endorse them, you believe them, you embrace them, you identify with them. But you were before every concept, because you are not a concept. So therefore, you can throw every concept. So that you can see what cannot be thrown, everything you can throw. Even this, I say, the lazy man's way to enlightenment. No work, no hill to climb, nothing to change, nothing to become, nothing to fix, nothing to heal. Pay attention only to your own self, but not your person. If I took your person away, what is left then? Isn't there something that will even witness the absence of person, presence of person, but it is unconcerned about it, because it is not affected by that? Hmm? Since I met your love